One of the important senior players at the Crinkle Footy Club is Steve McGuinness, whose brother Andrew had an brief AFL career at Carlton. I always thought he was a, a better player than the amount of games he played, but injuries didn't help him. But uh, you come across Steve from Devon Meadows, predominantly to play with your brother? Yeah, yeah, mainly to play with Andy and a few of the other boys that used to play at Devon Meadows were also here. So, yeah, good to be playing with them again. And what's it like playing with your brother? I mean, obviously a very good player. The injuries didn't help him too much at Carlton. As I said, I thought he was a, a very reliable, solid player who had a good career in front of him. I know a few Carlton supporters who I've spoken to in recent days when I said, oh, I'm working in a footy league that's got Coringle involved in it and Andrew McGuinness is there. And one of them said to me, he could play. Yeah, yeah, no, he could play, and uh, oh, it's just good to be playing with him, I guess. We, we sort of do everything together, so why not do footy together as well? And coming across from Devon Meadows to Carinkle, how different are the two clubs? Uh, yeah, well, if you look at the ladder, very differently uh, this year. <laughs> um, but, uh, yeah, we just, I don't know, we go about our business a bit differently and seems to be working at the moment. So You, yeah. you like to be understated, don't you, as a footy club? You're very professional, you're very open with us today. You, you seem really focused on wanting to achieve the ultimate, which is a premiership and then back to first division. Yeah, we're just taking it uh, one week at a time at the moment. So, yeah, we can only sort of beat who we come up against and we just go through the same process week by week and at the moment it's, it's working for us. So, yeah. No, it's good. You've been speaking to your brother about how to, how to talk to the media, haven't you, about the, the AFL, the word process. And uh, do you have, do you, I mean, do you, do, you, do you honestly feel if, if you get the process right every week, the result will take care of itself, or does it require a bit more than that? Uh, we just got to go out and play our game, and our game will beat most teams on the day. Um, but obviously we're trying to sort of break down every team and, and sort of negate what they like to do. But, yeah, at the moment it's sort of, yeah week by week and it's working well for us so we'll keep doing it. Do you feel you can beat anyone if you play your best footy? Do you feel your best footy is better than anyone else in the competition? Yeah, on our day, yeah, we'll, we'll beat everyone and anyone, so, yeah. You uh, say that I with a big smile on your face, uh, though. Uh, yeah, because I know it's probably going to get me in trouble later on in the year, but um, nah, yeah, we, we're pretty confident that if we play the right stuff, we'll, we'll get the job done. And having Brett Dunn as coach, what are you learning from him? Yeah, a bit, bit different. Dunny is uh, super professional, super prepared. Um, he's been a real sort of a real good change for me from uh, recent coaches. So, yeah, now nah, I'm loving it under Dunny, and yeah, hopefully we uh, can do him a solid one against his old mob today. What does he do that's a bit different to your other coaches that you sort of took a little while to get used to, Steve? Uh, he does a lot of game prep stuff, so yeah. he really looks at the tapes and breaks them down, and then sort of looks at what we're doing well and. Sort of, it's good if you can get the feedback and actually see what you're doing well and, and what you're not doing well. So, yeah, no, nah, it's been real good. Good on you, Steve. Good luck today. Thanks for joining us, and uh, it's been terrific to chat to so many Karingal people, and uh, you're certainly heading in the right direction. So, uh, good luck today and the rest of the season. Beautiful. Thanks, mate. Cheers. Good on you. Thanks, mate. Good on you.